Hey everybody, it's Never, and Guild Wars 2 is on Steam. And this is great, but this has led to a minor issue that some people are having where they already had an account and want to play with their original account through Steam. Now, if you've dug around a little bit in the community section in Steam, you may have found this piece of information where you can right-click the game, go to Properties, and then add Dash Provider Space Portal, which will force the game to use the default ArenaNet launcher after you launch it from Steam so you can log in with your original account. And this works great, but there's actually another thing you can do to make this even better if you already have the game installed. What we're going to do is create a symbolic link between where Steam is expecting to find the game and where you already have it installed. This is really easy to do, but it may be a little outside of most people's normal behavior. So you can see right here, this is my Steam directory. And if you go to where Steam is installed and you go to Steam apps and then common, you'll see a list of a bunch of games. And here is Guild Wars 2, but this one is different because this is just a link. And when I go to this link, it's actually going to where I had Guild Wars 2 installed in the first place. And so how we're going to create this is real simple. We just want to go to an administrative privileged command prompt in Windows, and the command is M-K-L-I-N-K, or make link. Then you need to use the switch J. It's a capital J with a forward slash before it, and that tells it to make something called a junction, which is a symbolic link to a directory or a folder, not just to a file. Then we just need to put two things wrapped in quotes because there's spaces in the title. So if, my, uh, if I wanted the link to show up where Steam is installed, then I would do for me, since I have Guild Wars 2 and Steam and everything on a separate drive, I would just type the path to it. And wrap it in quotes. So there, that's where it is for me. It might be different for you, but once you can find where Steam is installed and look at the directory, you want to create something like this. Then I want to tell it where am I going to go to find the thing I'm looking for, or where is the game already installed. And that's just going to look like this for me. And just like that. And so if I execute that, which I've already done, but if I execute that, then it'll tell me that it created a junction so that when Steam goes to look for Guild Wars 2, it will forward it over to where I already have the game installed. So then I don't need to install it twice or move things or anything like that. And I can continue to update and do anything I need to with the game where I already have it, but then Steam will also be able to find it. We're just telling Steam, hey, it's not really here, it's over there, and Steam doesn't know any different. And so then when I launch the game, it will bring up the default launcher and I can log in with my regular account and load the game from the exact same place I've been loading it the whole time. But then it'll all be tracked on Steam and everything. So that's how you can set it up to use your original account with Steam. I hope that helps. Okay, thanks, bye.